Here I have all of your X3 solar lights and let me show you how to go through the initializing setup process on the following device. So let me show you how to activate this phone. At the very beginning let's start by using a welcome panel. Here you've got list of all languages that you can use on this device. In my case let me choose English. For instance from United States. You may also choose emergency and make some emergency calls if you need something. If not let's go back and choose next arrow. You can insert SIM card but you can also activate your device without the SIM card. So let me do it that way for now let me just tap skip. You can connect your device to one of the available Wi-Fi. It's not necessary you can bypass this step but it's always a good idea to have an internet connection. So let me connect my device to my Wi-Fi. The device is obtaining IP address. And now the phone is checking connections. Wait a couple of seconds or maybe even a two minutes. And now you can add a Google account to your device. You don't have to do this. You can bypass this step by choosing skip. But I usually recommend this step so the Google account enables you some interesting features and if you would like to add your Google account you can do it in two ways. You can create a new Google account right here by using that link or use an existing one. So let me use an existing one, let's input my email. Let's tap next. Now it's time to enter a password, let me do it, wait a couple of seconds. If you are ready, let's tap next. If everything is alright, let's accept terms of service and privacy policy. And here we've got some features connected to a Google service. You can enable or disable automatically backup device data, help apps find your location, improve location accuracy, help improve your Android experience. Let me tap next. Now the device is asking you to set up payment info. Let me tap no thanks and tap continue. And now you have to decide either you would like to add another email or just use a Gmail or you can do it later in settings. So let me tap not now, tap next. You can protect your device by using pin, pattern or password. In my case let me don't use this option for now. You can always do it later. Let me tap skip right here, skip anyway. You can restore apps and data from one of your older devices or you can choose don't restore and set up your device without apps and data. So let me do it that way, choose don't restore. And that's it. Here we've got the tutorial, let's tap OK and now you can use your device. So thank you for watching, please subscribe our channel and leave thumbs up under the video.